It's 96, but it's 102. Wait, that doesn't sound right. It's supposed to be 96, but it feels like 102. This one here wants Slurpees. It's hot and falls, but yes, I'm burning. She's crazy. Too hot. But I bought this, so maybe that will help. This is all metal. She wants Slurpees. Yes. What do you have to say for yourself? I want the Slurpee. I am out here melting because of you. I want the Slurpee. I could be inside right now playing my video game, being nice and cool, but no. Somebody wants Slurpees. We've been playing that fucking game for like three temperature. hours. Yes. I want the Slurpee. I get something I want now. I'm playing Ark and I like to force feed animals until they love me. That's a part of the game, right? You know you got 10 seconds to cross. Yeah, 10 seconds. Four. She's going through my pants. I fart on me too. You know, it doesn't help that the lobby actually smells like fart anyway. Uh, it smells like garbage because the window's open in the lobby. So gross. Look, this Slurpee cup is finally coming in handy. This we thing, haven't used this all year. We haven't. I don't know that we even used it last year. This thing is metal and the straw is metal, so it's like stupidly cold. When you first fill it up too, it takes it a moment to uh, get all frosted over here, but I feel like... Actually, you can kind of see some of the ice, maybe. Not really, but... Not it, on camera, but when you first fill it up, you do see frost. Yeah, you, you see the frost. It's slicky right now, actually. <clears throat> so, the only way to keep your hand from freezing would be to... Uh, Hold the rubber. <laughs> and it's got a metal straw so it keeps it it keeps it cold. Um they only have cherry and they only have coke, so I wanna mix the two and in the hopes of making cherry coke flavor slurpee. <laughs> right now it's not working out, it's just kinda like segregated. There you go. So now for some reason now the frost popped up. That's the only spot. Only right there. I would totally lick the cup. No. No. No, no, no. Okay, let's start here. From the door to the corner to this corner behind this giant metal structure to this corner up the wall from that corner all the way down to here and ends there. Those my friends is how long a dollar's worth of painter tape is. I bought two rolls. This is my second row. You see how skinny this is? This is worth a dollar. And that is the length of a dollar worth of tape. That is not enough tape for you to kidnap somebody with. I said that out loud. Damn it. I'm gonna use the second row of tape. Finish up masking around the door. Behind the door. Maybe the furnitures. Maybe, eh, no, maybe, nah. I'm not gonna take my mouth for sure because um, if you factor out the tape, this is like two cents worth of tape to cover my big ass mouth. I'll see you guys in a bit. Why are you so loud, you fatty? 
I got home. It's late. This one was mad at me. Mad person. Mm -hmm. Why are you? Why are you why mad? Why don't you me? tell them why I was mad? I ain't gonna say it. It's totally not my fault. You're full of shit. I didn't poop today. That's why your eyes are brown. <laughs> you got Damn no comment! Damn it! Yes! She's oh. celebrating her victory. I was filming! I was using my phone, which has hyperlapse, and I was filming myself painting the freaking walls. And then she called, but then I, I was... I texted. I texted, an hour later, I called you. How is it that you want me to tell them and then you just keep interjecting? Because I'm trying to correct you. She's wrong. <laughs> You're so mean. Alright, so anywho's, <coughs> Miss Chicken Nuggets Craver. I came home to her. I text her. I came home. The door was locked. So I was like, oh, she must have fallen asleep. I walked in. TV's on. And then the first thing I checked was the couch. The couch was empty. So I lean over there and check the bedroom. She's not there. And then I lean over here and then there she's looking at me like, I'm gonna murderize you. Yeah. And then what did I tell you? Hmm. Don't remember, just... I really don't remember. You can remember all the shit beforehand, but you can't remember what I said to you. That is your problem. Oh, I know what you say. You said, she said, I hope you ate. <laughs> you skipped over a good chunk of that. Yeah, selective. Selective memory. Selective hearing too. I was going to conclude my night at my mom's. I just finished painting. She just got home. She actually works at a 9 to 9 job. Crazy. 12 hour shift. At 70, what, 75 years old? Yes. Yeah, little, little Asian lady that comes up to like here on me. So my tiny Asian mom, like all tiny Asian moms, likes to offer food. Oh <laughs> and I just finished painting, I got home. Oh, and the first thing she would ask is, did you just start a painting? And I'm like, observe first before you ask questions. She goes, I just got home, I just want to ask you a question. I'm like, no, no. <laughs> then I ignore her for a little bit, I got ready. And then she goes, did you eat yet? I'm like, no. Do you want food? No. I got some food. No. No. I made noodles. That's fine, mom. So you want my noodles? No. I can make another bowl. I'm okay. She has to ask the same, basically the same question, but in different ways. Basically, she's asking oh, if you want I am, food, but I am, like... I am, I am so not done. Oh my gosh. And then as I am, as I'm leave, like as I'm walking past her, she goes, Look, check out my bow, and I'll be like... <laughs> and then, lastly, as I'm walking by, she goes, Do you want to try some? And I'll be like, No... Uh... As I'm walking down the... Walking past her, just... And that's how I conclude the night at my mom's. With a long no. I'm hungry now, actually, and... I'm gonna make myself a bowl of noodles. It's okay. I ate. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. Not she went to Dun Dunkino. Dunkino do noodles. The noodles? The noodles? Dunkino do noodles. Okay, buddies. Good night.